What's up? Welcome back here for another video on Madden Mobile. JC Anandela 7 here. So as you see, under NFL Gauntlet, today is another Gauntlet day, and today is the day where I got my final collectible. So right here, it does say NFL Gauntlet Strength. This is the one that I was missing for quite a while. I used quite a lot of gold trophies to use exchange, and I never got strength. I've actually had 19 Gauntlet collectibles for about a month. And every time this live event came out, I tried to play as much as I can, could not get strength. So we finally got strength, so we'll go ahead and put it under our defense here. And let's go ahead and claim it. We get 50k plus the NFL Gauntlet defense, and if you guys don't know, I already have the offense from last month. So we're going to go ahead and claim it. Oh, what a beauty. There we go. So we get ourselves a 50k as well, so maybe I'll do some type of draft pack opening tomorrow. So you guys can look forward to that. I'm not so sure yet. Maybe if Manuel releases some new stuff. So anyway, what did you guys think of the NFL draft from last night? The first round, I know it was a lot of stuff to take in. A lot of surprises, obviously, with that whole Laramie Tunsil story. Um, with him smoking and stuff like that. And his Instagram and like Twitter got hacked or something like that, apparently. And yeah, his value did drop a lot. He went 13th overall to the Dolphins. Really good player, but um, let's hope that he can get his act together. We also got um, a couple of big name players. Uh, Paxton Lynch was actually headed to the Broncos because they did lose Osweiler to free agency. So that's pretty interesting. I wonder how he'll do there. Maybe he'll be better than the actual first and second quarterbacks that went in the draft, like Goff and Wentz. So... The round two and three will be coming up today, I believe. I think the rest of the rounds are tomorrow. Still got a lot of valuable players out there, like Miles Jack, um, Heisman winner Derrick Henry has not been chosen yet. So, yeah, a lot of stuff going on. Just want to give you guys that quick update. Sorry for that. I'll probably put a little time in the bottom, so if you guys just want to skip to this. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and put in this defense. I already sold my signature Justin Tuck. I sold actually before this. I was thinking that there will be a crash, not really a crash, um, with the new draft stuff out. But let's go ahead and claim it a 99 overall. J.J. Watt will might as well jump into some type of gameplay here, maybe a season's game to test his defensive abilities out. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and claim it right here. With that plus 5 tackle, plus 2 XP, and yeah, absolute sexy card right here. Not auctionable. I think there was some type of glitch earlier that it made him auctionable but look at those 99s and 98s absolute beauty so yeah let's gonna go ahead into our team and let's move him into our team and I'll go ahead and jump into seasons game for you I'll actually edit out some parts because I don't want to be showing you the offense because he has really no value on offense obviously so yeah I just have this guy in for now let's drag him in obviously my defense won't be my highest overall because I do have two cornerbacks I've saved out but look at that that front line is looking strong right now um, bj raji might be replaced i'm not so sure yet but yeah that's how the defense is looking like one of these spots should be slotted for Deion sanders and another one i'm not so sure what to do with so if you guys have any cornerback selections or any type of cornerbacks you recommend drop in the comments down below and i'll really appreciate it but any guys let's go ahead and jump into some seasons mode and test out this jj watt Hello guys, we're back here under our seasons game. I literally got the ball and I ran a couple plays. I'm like, you know, why not? It's first down, I'll just punt it. So I just punted it to them. So we'll just test out a couple plays that we can use JJ Watt in to really show his really significant stats on his card. So right here, we can just do a regular Kevin, uh, oh dang, cover one right there. And JJ Watt just got plummeled right there. Uh, maybe we'll do it with the under smoke, see how this blitz will work on Aaron Rodgers here. JJ Watt looks pretty explosive. Um, dropped the ball, Randall Cobb right there. But um, yeah, it looks like Watt has got insane speed off the ball, off the side right here. Um, looks like he can get to Rodgers right there. Get that nice sack, making it fourth down. So it looks like they'll be having to punt it to us here. I'm just gonna go ahead and probably just punt it right back to them, just do a couple more plays. We'll just let this ball maybe uh, rolled out or something I'm not so sure okay and it bounces all the way back maybe I'll let it like touch okay yep he picks it up right there so we'll just go ahead and punt this back and we'll do another rerun of a couple plays with JJ Watt for you guys to enjoy 
just punt it right back to him. There we go. So yeah, NFL draft tonight. Got some pretty interesting stuff going on. Not so sure if it's going to be enjoyable. I don't really usually watch after pretty much past the second round. I don't really pay attention to it. I mean, obviously, you do have some pretty good players, some definitely hidden gems that you'll find from this NFL season that are drafted from rounds four and later. But obviously, I don't watch it. Um, it gets boring after a while. I know some of you guys might enjoy it, but uh, it gets long after every pick, especially because you get 10-minute clock. I don't know. I think it's shorter. I'm not so for sure if it's shorter, but it's a long clock. And each pick, they're usually running down to the last minute, and the commissioner has to take time to walk out and stuff like that. So it's quite a while, and they complete the first down right there. So it is uh, end of the first quarter here. We'll run a couple more plays here, see what J.J. Watt can do. Maybe let's do an inside man. Oh, that's where. This is J.J. Watt. And, okay, Bowman intercepts it. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy this little type of uh, gameplay for J.J. Watt. He looks like an absolute sick player. Definitely happy for him to be added to our team. So our next two goals for our team is to get Odell Beckham Jr. Just need to play head-to-head. Head-to-head -head is just stressful to play. I know you guys, um, some of you guys do have Odell Beckham, but it's a pain in the butt to actually play the head-to-head -head games. And Deion Sanders, you just need to do a lot of trophy sets and hope to get some elite trophies there. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you drop a like and subscribe if you're new. We're nearing to 250 subs, so thank you guys for that. And yeah, a giveaway will come out soon, I promise. Definitely we will do a $10 iTunes gift card for you all. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow with another video. Love me, love me, love me.